So I put out this Ewan, Lady of Rohan, and I dub Quende. Throw this out for good measure on Quende. Swing out. Yeah, I'll give this guy a good old goose. I'm so excited. Oh, what up? It's Quende, though. You all voted for me to make Quende Pride of Femoref as a second deck in my Altered Historic Brawl series. So, we're making a second deck. This deck, uh, we definitely want first strike people, of course, because they get double strike. And so we have a minute amount of things, like Chaplain of Alms. Gonna have some first strike. Um, I was thinking there was some other... Like, Dub. Dub gives first strike. Um, all of the Skyclaves gives first strike. So we have a few things to help give us first strike. We have lots of other equipment. Team Pennant, Shadow Spear, Arrow Blade, Basilisk Collar, True Faith Sensor, which gives us some Vigilance. Maybe throw on a Thran Power Suit. We got, like, the Zenith Chronicler in here, so we can maybe draw some extra card. Like, the One Ring, Solemn Simulacrum, for more draw extra card. There's this Dusk Legion Duelist where, man, maybe we can get some plus one counters on him and we can draw some cards. Uh, if that's the case, though, we need like a Luminarch Asparent out or, um, what is it? Beladar Retreat. That also gives us some plus one counters. Uh, Siege Veteran. More plus one counters. If we get the plus one counters coming off, we don't have tons of them in the deck. We got Cigar to Summons, so we can turn everything into Flying Angels. Hopefully with Double Strike. Speaking of that, we got First Strike, which is going to be Double Strike, Baneslayer Angel. We have a uh, Platoon Dispenser for more draw. We got somebody like Danitha in here to make use of the equipment. Also with First Strike. Tons of these uh, mana rocks, basically, so we can make sure we're getting stuff out. And we got the couple of swords that are not protection from white in here. I'm thinking this deck is going to bang, bang. So let's see if we can bang, bang, bang. That's a lot of mana. That's like all mana all the way down. Ugh, I don't know if that's even good. I mean, if I get into a really good draw outlet, this would go crazy, boy. But I don't know if I'm going to do that. Let's just do a moly. Too much land on that. This is fine. This is much, much more doable. And we have a draw outlet. All right, keep. Big keep. We got two tap lands to begin with, which isn't the best. Here's the fair bacilla. It's very fair. Very fair. Going against a Marrow Gnaller. Oh, it's a Rat Colony. How could I have possibly have guessed? It's a Plains. It's a Mirror Shield. Oop. It cometh upon us. I could really use like a three drop creature right about now. Burnished Heart. That's good. That's not a three drop creature. Uh, here is the gate to the Citadel, my friend. Two or more other creatures. So I need three creatures for this platoon dispenser to go off. Send your rat colony my way, bud. I'm ready for it. Hey, that's a planes. Put that planes out. Uh, Quende. Pride of Femoref. Big Chief. The Stronky Donkey. Olus Citadel. Uh oh. That's not great. A labyrinth of Scophos into a gilded lotus into a mall of the skyclaves on Quende swing out for eight. That's all right. I'll take that. Let's see if he has an answer for Quende here. Or if he just... You know, Piper of the Swarm wants to maybe gain control of one day. Oh, yeah. Puts out all the rat colonies. Another rat colony. Big rat colonies. Rat colonies from hell. I think I'll win, though. If I can dub one day. 
and hit for 12 here. If he gains any more life, though, I won't win. Oof. Yeesh. That was mean. I dubbed the very good. Um, so I put out this Ewan, Lady of Rohan, and I dub Quende. Throw this out for good measure on Quende. Swing out. Yeah, I'll give this guy a good old goose. I'm so excited. And Narset, Enlightened Exile. Hmm, kind of big hand. At least there's a letter of acceptance, but we'd have to draw into a land to get there. Got a lot of power if we move forward, though. Uh, let's try it out. Uh, deck link in the description if you want to see it for yourself. Subscribe button's right next to it. If you're not, they're throwing out an opt. How dare you, sir? You did it on your turn, too. You could have done it at the end of my turn. I might have been like, oh my god, he has a turn one counter. For none of my cards. Here's a minus turf. Earth. I like his ghost man. Cold steel heart. Nice. It's a planes. And it's a letter of acceptance. I do accept. Got my soldier. I got this cool. He's like a knight. Rider. He's got this spooky boy. For Narset. Probably because it recurs instants and sorceries from the graveyard. I'll accept that as canon. Uh, Celebrity Fencer. Yeah. Like to see it. Like to see it. Elspeth. I could put a first strike counter on the Fencer. Hmm. I think the Defiler Faith comes next. Probably should have even done the Defiler Faith first. Here he is. Defiler of Faith. Do I swing out with my 4 4? Probably. Why well, wouldn't? Defiler of Faith is going to be a problem for you, too. They're both problems. Whenever I cast a white permanent, 1 5, create a Bird illusion. Okay. I see. You're going to cast some spells here in a second. Aren't you, bud? Here's Elspeth Resplendent. Just normal. We'll just throw it out normal. I'll make a soldier. You going to counter? No, you're not. No, you will not. And then we can go ahead and bang and throw. Maybe I'll throw up. Vigilance on you. Oh, I'm gonna do something. Exile creature you control. Bring it back, bring it back. Interesting. Uh, maybe I'll do... You can hit me for four. I'll do a Vigilance. And then... A couple of big swings for turn. You could take out the Defiler of Faith if you block. Oh, no, you can't, actually. Takes five. Do I hit him with a Delver's Torch for two life? Probably. Make another soldier boof up. Should have done that before I swung. Got rebound. Doing it again. Having a boy bounce more. Illusions. Calling cards. Boy's coming back in town. It's kind of interesting what you're doing with this guy. He is a murmuring mystic. You're, you're casting spells, though. We love to see it. I wonder if I have enough. So that's three, and that's four. One, two, three. One, two, three. So if I get one more land and pay for life, I could probably just absolutely obliterate a boy. I mean, he does have this illusion, I guess. I don't have trample. Narset, not what we want to see. Not at all what we want to see. Um, and it's a tapped land anyway, so. That is what it is, my son. It's Quende. We'll throw him out normal. I'm not too worried about that. Get another plus one counter. Make an... Uh, 
do all that. Oh, it's a three cost equip. That's unfortunate. We can definitely throw Let's do a first strike counter. We can do a flying counter. What does it matter? We'll swing here. Do we swing here too? We give it a try. Yeah, we'll just give it a try. What's the worst he's going to do? Kill me? Yeah, he's just going to take five to face. So he has to make another illusion, basically, to not die. But he's on the back burner over here. We got big boys. Oh, I, I can still give this guy a first strike counter on the next one. If only I could give him trample, too. If I bring out this Boonbringer Valkyrie, he's extra toast and jam. Yeah, so he's just good and dead. And then a Lotus. I can throw out a Lotus. I might as well. I and mean, we can throw this out while we're at it. Does he counter this? Yeah, that's what I thought. Go ahead and equip it on over here. He must have something up his sleeve. Let's just take him to ch to town. Here. Let's just take him to town. Make a bunch of angels. Yeah. We'll light up every dark corner of this city. He doesn't like that. So it's a 1717 with vigilance. I'm just waiting for him to do something to it. Swing these directions. Do I lose my faith? Yeah, we can lose the defiler of faith. Otherwise we're just popping him for, you know, five. If he does something to the defiler. Oh, okay. Draw this card. Made an illusion, so that's good for you. He got what, one more turn? One to go. Can block with the murmuring mystic at this point. Makes another bird. It's a plus one counter on our set. Chooses white. So I lose the defiler to Narset then. I knew he had something up his sleeve. I was ready for it. Blocks there. I'm going to have so many flyers this next turn. He's not going to know what to do. He's going to have zero idea of how to move. You may swing. I have a 1717. It's not probably the best idea unless you have removal, which you haven't had yet, which is kind of interesting. You're like bouncing your guys, which is good, but not my guys. You know, some plus one counters. You're thinking. I can clearly see it in your eyes. Return instant sorcery to your hand. So he's going to bounce his mystic. Or bounce Urbor. I mean, either one you could bounce. Theoretically speaking. So making more creatures, you could swing. I mean, you can't really swing at me. What does this do? Instant sorceries in your graveyard. Okay, well here's a roadside reliquary. We'll go ahead and equip um, Wende here. Oh, and he's just done. It's a feast. That's where I felt I was getting ready to be feasting. All right, another chip on the old. Wind day, wind day block. Um, Aldratha, who's blue and black. Draw into one land, I can get a Relic of Legends out. We'll try it, we'll try it. Give it a try, my guy. Quende might be the one, unless they obliterate something I'm doing with Muldratha. Uh, 
is a very I don't even know elf mod, modern elf basic assass basic girl assassin here's the planes here's a core halibird for a one it's ready to give vigilance to somebody fable passage I need to draw a land He's searching. He got a really cool looking swamp out. I threw out a Mishra's bobble. What you see? I'm ready to know. It was a planes. Just what I wanted. And we can put out a Thran power suit. What do you know? What do I know? Barely any of us know anything. We're just micro specs in this cosmic universe. It's a, another planes. And a relic of legends. The legendary relic. A dryad of Elysian Grove. It's a good one. Stitcher Supplier. You're gonna totally block with him. Um Castle Ardenvale. Quende coming in the ring. Throwing a core halberd on him over here. Going to combat and ending turn. One day's ready to come at you, my guy. He's got vigilance, too. He's probably about to get... Fly oh, goodbye me. Take action, put Quende back. I knew he'd do some pull something like that out. Idyllic Grange. It's Quende. Pride of Femoreth. Cannot be stopped. Um can go ahead and just equip him. I know I'll have to tap him, but it's fine. Discard a card. How about the team pendant? We don't need it. Silverback Elder. We'll throw out Bang here. Um, hit him with that. Chat, chat. Mall of the Skyclaves. Is this an equip of two? Which I don't have. But I can do the power suit. Bang. Next. Swing out. Hit you for 16 in the air. <laughs> you got one turn left. My guy. You're probably going to destroy Quinde somehow. Destroy my mall of the Skyclaves. That might be what you do. Because you can do that with the Elder, right? Yeah. Blossoming Tortoise. What are you destroying? Mall of the Skyclaves? And it was the mall of the Skyclaves. Who would have thunk it? Who would have thunk it, my Jung? Lotus Cobra, that's a cool looking Lotus Cobra. Shadow Spear, just what you need to not die. Give it to the bad boy. Tap another artifact, draw a card, then discard a card. Make a little baby human. Um, sorta of once in future. So this hits out. I have just enough to equip it. Boom. Go ahead and do the equip on her. 8-8. Eight, eight. Combat. I just killed a Silverback Elder before it even deals damage. A little bit of death in my turn. Now I just need Trample. Or Flying again. That was nice. He's got time to think about it. He's got time to figure it out. He's got time to try it around. He might get Moldrotha out. He does. Moldrotha destroys another artifact, weakening Quinde. Getting rid of my sword of once and future. Destroying something else of mine. The Vigilance. Oof. Alright, I need to... <laughs> I don't know at this point. 
We aren't looking too hot, boys. Looking like we're about to get spit out and shoot up. It's not a good situation for us at this point. It's getting rid of the Thran power suit. Quende is just a baby. Just an itty bitty boy. Mishra's bobble knows what I've got going on. Wow. No block. Well, I think that was the battle, boys. Resolve. Oh, yep. Let me let me have whatever it is. Celebrity fencer. Go ahead and go for it. Will call. No swing. I'll give him a. I'll give him a uh, angry goose. Maybe I'll give him some rats too. Here's your pile of rats, boy. Cause I'm I'm the one that says rats. I'm ready to do some tea and biscuits when this man's ready for some tea and biscuits. Getting rid of my Relic of Legends. Nope. Doesn't care about the Relic of Legends. He's like, you can have it. I'm about to utterly obliterate you. Sack a creature, the fencer. Get rid of him. Don't need him. Because I'm dead no matter what. Shield red. Getting rid of... Nope. Just drawing out. Ball in that ball out, boy. Field red. Destroying the relic of no. Oh yeah, destroying the relic of legends. That sixteen. That's twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. He's really only hitting me for fifteen. Not giving him any tea. You're a madman, my boy. A madman. That's a block here. Yeah, you were like, you could have killed me. You didn't. You should have swung out with everybody. Decline. Not even putting my commander back. Care not to draw. Resolve. I got a haunted fangraph we're going to go off with. Putting something back in my hand. Who knows what it is? Hand. He's back in my hand. And there's nothing you can do about it. Uh, did he make me discard a card? Decline. Put, keep him in the graveyard. We don't need him. He's a punk. He's a punk hoe. Alright, I'm out. I'm out this level. I lost. All right, hey, it's the end of the video. Two and one's not bad, right? Quende, kind of powerhouse mode with that particular deck style. I got some more packs to open. We're going to open an elusive, what is it, mythic pack as well. I got a little restless spire. Enters tapped, adds red or blue, pay red or blue. It becomes a 2-1 blue and red elemental creature with, as long as you return this creature as first strike, it's still a land. When it attacks, you scry one crazy hard in scales. Uh-oh, one green. If one or more plus one plus one counters would be put on a creature, you control that many plus one plus one plus one counters are put on instead. So yeah, you get just an extra every time. One extra. Boom, we got another pack. It's a dangerous pack. It's got Mary Bards, a red and two human bard. Creature three, two. When they enter the battlefield, you can pay one. When you do, create a young hero roll token attached to target creature you control. And Decadent Dragon. Fancy. Two red and two dragon creature. Four four with flying and trample. Whenever it attacks, create a treasure token. It also has expensive taste for a black and two instant adventure. Exile the top two card of target opponent's library face down. You may look at and play those cards for as long as they remain exiled. Cool. And... Let's see what this Mystic Pack's all about. What up, Mystic Pack? It's a Tangle Span Lookout. A green and two. Satyr creature. Two, three. Whenever an aura enters the battlefield under your control, draw the card. Cool. 
Solitary, Sanctuary, a white and two enchantment. When it enters the battlefield, tap target creature and opponent controls and put a stun counter on it. Whenever you tap an untapped creature and opponent controls, put a plus one plus one counter on target creature you control. And Kellen, me boy. Alright, thanks for stopping by today. I really appreciate your time. Uh, please hit that subscribe button if you made it this far and you're still listening. Like, what are you doing? I'm assuming you already are subscribed. And if you're not, help me get to 100 by the end of October. Later.